How's it going everyone? My name is Chris and welcome to Path to Wellness. Today's video is five easy and effective ab exercises, how to get shredded abs. So if you're not yet subscribed to the channel, you want to see more on fitness, a healthy lifestyle, a plant-based diet, or intermittent fasting, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and check the bell so you're notified of my new videos. And let's get started. So I got five easy and effective ab exercises in this video today. These are my favorite ab exercises. And I'm just gonna mention before I show you the moves that in order to get shredded abs, you can't just do a whole bunch of ab exercises. You need to combine some different elements of a healthy lifestyle if you wanna have a fit body and shredded abs. So when you combine a clean diet, lots of plant-based foods, lots of clean food, lots of fruits and vegetables, Calorie dilute foods helps clean you out. When you combine that with an intermittent fasting or a fasting focused lifestyle and the right type of exercises, make sure you're doing strength training to strengthen your whole body and you're getting good rest and good recovery and good sleep, that is gonna be the key to getting shredded abs. You need to do all those things put together. So with that being said, here are the exercises. The first move is side plank leg raises. So go on a side plank with a forearm, either on the left side or right side. Get your body off the ground so you're really using your core. Keep your leg as straight as possible. And then you can do 8 to 12 reps touching your toes to your fingertips. And then once you do 8 to 12 reps, flip over to the other side and do the other side. Now make sure you stay, stick around because after this workout, I'm going to be doing a post-workout smoothie. So you don't want to miss that. All right, the second move are these plank knee to elbows. So get in a plank position with your forearms on the ground. Keep your body off the ground using your core and then raise the knee to the elbow one side at a time. You can do 10 to 20, 10 to 20 reps of this. is great for a set. Third move is called in and outs. So get in a push-up position and then Jump in to your hands, try to keep your legs straight if you can, and then jump back out. Another variation of this move is you could do two jumps or three jumps to get your hand to get your feet to your hands. So they'd be smaller jumps. But I prefer just doing the one jump in and one jump out. Great core move here. Next move is mountain climbers. Another one, another one of my favorite moves. I like to go to cross back and forth, side to side like this, opposite knee to opposite elbow. You can also just do this where you put the knee to the same elbow. So either way, and this is the way that I like to do it here. Last move are hanging leg raises. Now this is the more difficult one where you keep your legs straight and you bring them all the way up to the bar. There are some different modifications, which I'm also gonna show you in this video in just a second where you can just raise your leg halfway, keep them straight, but just bring them up halfway. And then to further modify, you can actually just bend your knees and then bring them up to your chest. So different, different variations, modifications for that. Stick around because now I'm gonna show you the post-workout smoothie. It's absolutely delicious and nutritious. And here it is. So I started off with two frozen bananas I have three dates that were soaked in water, and I use the water and the dates. It's called date water. I used three tablespoons of soaked chia seeds. I used one cup of frozen blueberries. I have two scoops of the Marcus Roscrans Green Pro C Mix, so the powdered greens and berries, really good for you. A couple tablespoons of cacao powder and a glass of almond milk and two tablespoons of raw almond butter. So this is a great combination. It's like a chocolate milkshake smoothie, super nutritious, turned out to be just over a liter. So thanks for watching everyone. Contact me if you want some one-on-one -on -one coaching. Give a thumbs up if you liked the video and we'll see everyone tomorrow. Have a great day, bye-bye.